Hey everyone! Recently we've been pretty obsessed with creating brand new Pokemon using an artificial intelligence. We've input all the fire starters and left the program to run, so let's take a look at what we got. This batch is a bit more varied than our last fire starter batch. They seem for the most part to kind of be litten and tepid color schemed, but their shapes and sizes vary wildly. If you're interested in getting a closer look at all of them, I'll publicly post this AI output sheet on our Patreon, but there was just a couple of them that really stood out to me. This guy immediately caught my attention. He has all of the Pokemon things going on. I absolutely love him. His eyes are super adorable. He's got this little nose. He's got like eyebrows that are like flourished out. He has like a big bone in front of him and he looks like a little dog or rabbit. He's got a big horn. He's just really cool. This one is kind of skating that line between is it adorable or is it terrifying? Is it a Pokemon or is it like an alive teddy bear type thing? <laughs> it's got like really kind of threatening eyebrows to me for some reason. Like just those downturned and its face, I can't tell if it's happy or if it's kind of got like a, like that sadistic face on. <laughs> I don't know why. I really like it though. It came out incredibly nice. It looks like a bunny with a big head or a teddy bear or something like that. I didn't really expect to see a fire oddish, but there it is. It's cool. This one's very wolfy or like fantasy creature mixed with Pokemon. I really, really like it. We already got like an Arcanite and stuff like that, but having like a wolf fire dark hybrid type would be really cool. I know Houndour already exists. It's kind of like overplayed maybe a little bit, but you really can never have too many wolves. I love wolves. Wolves with wings are cool. It's just a fact of life. This one looks like a snake head, which I thought was very cool. You can definitely see that's a frill. Maybe it's more like a skink or like a lizard instead with like those little tiny legs at the front. And then it's got this big kind of sharp hook that could be its tail or like the flame. I really like this one too. I think that this could be a cool Pokemon. Fiery snakes. Fiery snakes would be cool. But they were all pretty cool though, if I'm being honest. This is the time where we like to pick our favorite and bring it to life as a 3D model. We chose this little adorable puppy jackalope creature. We thought it could be cool to have another Cubone Marowak type creature that uses a bone as part of its moves and evolution. Plus, it was just so perfect. It has all the right shapes and coloring and just immediately felt like a Pokemon. If you're interested in checking out all of the results we've gotten so far, we've got them posted on our Patreon. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe, leave us a like, and tell us what you think in the comments. Thank you again. Stay safe. I love you all.